I applied to Berkeley College of Music and I didn't get in. And at the time that that happened, I was 17 and I decided that I was going to be a professional musician. But I, in that decision was the internal assumption that I was getting into Berkeley. And not getting into Berkeley made me realize that I maybe didn't want to be a professional musician. I took that as saying, you're not good enough. Um, and what ended up happening was I got into this other school in Boston. And when I went there, I said, well, I'm just going to go here to get like my gen eds out of the way and then I'm going to transfer. And it turns out, uh, as I got to Boston, that a good friend of mine who I was in bands with in high school, maybe you've heard of him. His name is Ben Levin. Uh, he was at Berkeley at the time. He was a year ahead of me. So when I got to Boston, Ben asked if I wanted to play in his band, which was so awesome. So when I got to college, I'd already started being in a band with this guy who was at Berkeley. And I started to reconnect with some people who went to Berkeley, who I knew from these summer camps, these five weeks. And so this thing happened where I went to the school in Boston. There was not a music school, but I started to play with people who went to Berkeley. And as that year passed and I got some gen eds out of the way, I thought, you know, I'm playing with people I want to play with. I'm, I'm writing some music. I can take music classes at the school that I'm at that has a good music school. And I think I'm just going to do that. And I think what's built into this is <clears throat> this thing happened by not getting into Berkeley that I took as a decisive measure of the universe that said, you are not cut out to pursue a career as a musician. And that was like the... I, I've been wrong about a lot of things in my life, but that's the thing I've been the most wrong about. Because if you talk to people who go to Berkeley or people who don't go to Berkeley or any music school like that, the people who I look up to who have the kinds of the careers in music and who have the kinds of life making music um, that I aspire to have, where they go and where they get training is not as much of an indicator for that as much as their drive, their ability to uh, self-motivate and self-learn, um, their ability to surround themselves with really talented people that'll keep them motivated, that'll keep them um, you know, bettering themselves. And that's been my takeaway. You know, I didn't get into Berkeley, but I, you know, I was very driven um, and I, decided that I wanted to be a professional musician, even though I didn't go to that school. And um, it hasn't stopped me yet. Mm -hmm.